I'm so excited to be doing this unboxing, you guys. I went to YouTube Beauty Fest. I'm talking to two cameras here, so bear with me. I went to YouTube Beauty Fest. It was such a fun time, and I have oodles, like oodles of things. I will bring this bag over here to show you guys. It's huge. I have the biggest unboxing to do, so I'm not going to waste any time. I've got my eye patches on. I'm ready to rock and roll. So without further ado, let's dive in. Um, all right, Emma Chamberlain, we know, we love her. Super excited about that. I actually have already tried these before. All right, Jonathan Van Ness, Queer Eye, any fans out there? This is a complete air dry cream. I'm assuming for your hair, um, work desired amount for a buildable texture and shine. Awesome. Next, we've got some hum vitamins. I've never tried these before, so I'm excited to try this. These are for digestion. Love that. You guys, this is going to be, I'm going to have to move through these quickly. Elizabeth Arden, we've got a retinol ceramide capsules night serum. Oh my gosh. I think these are the capsules that you break open. You like pop them open and then add product. I'm pretty sure that's what these are. Hi, Gobi. What time is it? Uh, like 8 p.m.? I'm in Los Angeles. All right. We've got St. James. Oh, CBD Lip Shine. I've actually tried this CBD Lip Shine before. It's pretty good. Um, maybe I'll do a giveaway with that. I've already tried it. More Emma Chamberlain. I really like her coffee. There's actually a bunch of Emma Chamberlain coffee stuffed in here. Next we've got, what is this? Real Beauty Miracle Barrier Cream. I think this is, um, is it a celebrity or influencer brand? Real Beauty Barrier Cream for Acne Prone Skin. Might give that away. Ooh, Glossier Future Dew Oil Serum Hybrid. Hey, Nadia. Hey, Ash. What's going on, guys? Um... Future Dew Oil Serum Hybrid. I actually prefer Glossier's skincare over their, um, their makeup. That's just my own personal preference. But I will say I do really enjoy their new eyeliner pencils that actually launched on YouTube this week. I was excited to be a part of that. Okay, I've never heard of this brand before. Goldie Watermelon Glow for Skin Hydration. Looks like a little pack that you add to, I guess, water baby. So that's exciting. All right, this is new for me. Benefit Shelly. Is this a bronzer? Sees the day. Oh, it's blush. Let's open it right this second. I, if I was stranded on an island, I always say this. I would use, ooh, she's pretty. Like a peachy color. I would bring um, blush and mascara with me. Those would be two of the things I would bring. I think I know what this is. Oh my gosh. I'm actually, I got invited yesterday to a Youth to the People event. I want to leave this in here in case I give it away. Um, this is their superfood cleanser. It comes in a glass container like this. It is made with spinach and what does it say? Green tea and spinach and kale. This cleanser, if you're like a beginner to skincare, I thoroughly enjoy. Um, and if you're just joining, by the way, I went to YouTube Beauty Fest and I have a bajillion goodies stuffed into this bag as well as a ton of bags beside me and I'm just going to be unboxing and talking with you guys. Ooh, this is good. This is good. Biosense. So I really like Biosense, their oil. Let's see what this is. This is their serum. Their squalane. So squalane, if you're unfamiliar with um, squalane, it is made from shark liver. I think. And now I'm second guessing myself. Ooh, so it's a serum in a container like this very excited about that this is a more high-end price point brand but it is wonderful if you're looking to splurge okay ola henriksen oh nadia you have a port wine stain you used to cover it but now you love it oh i love that so much yeah blush has always helped me feel a little bit more confident about having a vascular birthmark simply because i feel like i can even out the skin tone on this side of my face so i feel you on the blush so this is a Firmly Yours Toning Dry Body Oil. I have no idea how a body oil is toning, but that sounds intriguing. Okay. Naturium Purple Ginseng Cleansing Balm. So I like cleansing balms, but I actually prefer to take my makeup off with makeup erasers. But 
nonetheless we'll probably try that out oh this is a newer brand i think for sephora this is slather topicals exfoliating body serum all these products are like interesting they're like hybrids of uh, of like a couple different things slather all over your body two to three times a week for as much as you can tolerate so it says it's a retinol lactic acid squalane that's interesting i think it's more of like a chemical exfoliant for the body i wonder if these are all like newly launched products because i am like pretty tapped in to the beauty industry and i don't know a lot of these um elizabeth arden we've got more of those capsules i'll put those together what's this kosas ooh, their air brow fluff and hold gel so i've been using kosas there um i hope i'm not missing any comments make sure um kosas they have a wonderful um concealer that i've been using which i really enjoy and if you guys are just joining, have any questions for me, um, definitely pop it in the chat. I have a lot to go through. Oh, we got more Kosas Wet Plumping Lip Gloss Treatment. If there's anything that you guys want me to try while we're going through this, let me know. Olaplex, number three, repair and strengthens all hair types. My mom has been using Olaplex and has been really enjoying it. I've never tried Olaplex, so that's exciting. Ooh, MAC, have not tried anything from MAC in a long time. Hey, Idaho Spud, what's up? So I'm doing a huge unboxing. I went to YouTube Beauty Fest today um, and they gave us a bunch of freebies. So this is Dazzle Shadow Liquid from MAC. Let's take a peek. Ooh, I feel like my mom will like that. Really pretty. I have realized that I'm just like not a big eyeshadow person. I love the look of it on other people, but just don't love it on me. Okay, EOS, we all know this brand. They make those little Easter egg shaped lip balms and this is a shave cream. Could always use a little bit of that. Looks like we have another shade in the Shelly Benefit blush. Um, I don't wanna open a second one. So we will put this over here. It was your birthday yesterday, happy birthday. Um, Belief Aqua Balm Makeup Removing Cleansing Balm, like a little travel makeup balm, that's cute. What is this? Creamy deep conditioner for curly hair. Love that. I actually have pretty curly hair. Sorry, my cat is jumping around. Um, all right, let's take this big, big, big baby out. So, oh, yes, we got the beach wafer. Have you guys tried the beach wafer? I am super jazzed. I pretty much always use a curler over um, straightening, so I'm excited to give that a try. Okay, a little Revlon Matte Lip Crayon. Let's move through this a little quicker. MAC Lip Pencil. All right, sorry, uh, I got a little distracted. We've got Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. Oh my gosh, this smells so good, but I actually really enjoy. They have a couple of new flavors, like a pink container and a blue container that smell really freaking good. Oh, okay, so we've got a big belief. This is the um, True Cream Aqua Mom. Oh, Rare Beauty. I wonder if there's more Rare Beauty in here. This is their mascara. I have not tried uh, Rare Beauty mascara yet, but I have been looking for this one shade in the Rare Beauty blush that has been sold out everywhere. Looks like a little mini Olaplex serum. So that's cool. Someone said microchip. Yeah, I have like a little microchip in my thumbnail. It's really not that serious. Everyone's freaking out over it, but you just scan your phone under, over it and then you can follow me on like Instagram and stuff. It's pretty cool. Oh, I've tried this mascara. This is a great mascara, so I'll definitely give that away. It is from Lancome. Um, what is it called? Idol. This is a little baby belief product. Love that. What do we have here? Okay, so another rail. I don't know how if I'm saying this right. R A E L. Rail? Rail? Ray? Rail? Um, clarifying toner. Coolsies. What's this? Milani mascara? Yeah. Milani mascara. I love trying new mascaras. Like I said, mascara and blush are two of my favorite products. Oh, I've never heard of this brand. Lovi. Lola V. Lola V. Glossing Detangler. I am the queen of naughty hair, so that will come in handy. Ooh, more Ola Hendricks in it. Um, this is a strength trainer peptide boost moisturizer. I 
love the Ola Hemrickson. If you're ever at Sephora, you're looking for a good moisturizer, they have a lemonade um, exfoliant that is just absolutely to die for. What is this? Oh, youth to the people, but what is it? The skincare of now, pro grade vegan. Superfood science, shall we open it? Because I don't know what it is. Let's see. Clinical retinol that does it all. <gasps> you see how cool that was? Whee. Hi, mom. <laughs> um, wow, okay. I don't know what this is. It is a retinol. I think this is their new launch. They invited me to an event. And I think this is what it's celebrating. So I want to revisit this, but that's cool. A little uh, retinol situation. Oh, yay. So I actually met Patrick Starr today. Hi, mom. Um, I met Patrick Starr today and he was telling me and a couple other people about this mattifying waterproof spray. I've been using the Charlotte Tilbury setting spray, but um, if you like a matte look, I think this will be for you. So I'm excited about that. Okay. Oh, so this is what we had looked at before. Looks like more watermelon glow, skin hydration, dietary supplement, natural watermelon flavor, pomegranates. They're like little sticks that you put into your water. Apparently it makes your skin look good. Love that. Looks like more Ola Henriksen. No. Tata Harper, hydrating floral essence. They were actually at the event today and they had run out, so they gave us all $100 gift cards. So I'm curious to see their product. Hydrating Floral Essence. Shall we? Smells good. Tata Harper. Never heard of them before today. Have you guys heard of Tata Harper? Am I, am I late to the game or something? I think they've been around for a long time. Let's move right along. Okay, another Rail Beauty cleanser. Let's see what this is. Revlon. I have no idea. Oh, oil. Oh, this looks cool. So it's an oil roller. I saw someone use this on TikTok or YouTube. But if you're oily, you'd literally just roll, it's like a little lava rock or something that absorbs oil. You just roll it over your oily areas and it absorbs it. You've never tried, you've tried it. You've tried this, the oil roller thing, and it's really cool. Okay, awesome. Um, just so you guys know, I'm live on YouTube as well, so I've got two different cameras going here. I've got my iPad and my phone. Okay, so I did meet Solo Wave tonight. They were at the event, and I'm not sure if this is gonna work with my birthmark or not. It's a skincare wand, so this is actually UV, what is it, red light therapy with microcurrents, and it says to use it for five minutes a day. It's got a rotating head, and it's vibrates. So I'm gonna have to do more research on this because I'm not quite sure if I wanna use that on my birthmark or not. Okay, more Rail Beauty, more clarifying toner. Whoops, awesome. Uh, what's this? Second Chance Dry Shampoo. You can always use some dry shampoo. Never heard of that brand before. Ooh, we've got a third blush, so I definitely have to give some of these away. This is from Benefit. Looks like a new shade in their blush range. Do do. Big One Micellar Oil Cleanser. So this is um, Ashley Graham's brand, uh, Fig. I've never, I think it's her brand, right? Yeah, it is. Um, I've never tried it before, Micellar Oil Cleanser. I don't even know where that's sold, maybe just online. Okay, next we've got Edom. These are a lot of new brands for me. I like that YouTube's kind of branching out. Skin on Cloud9. Moisturizer. Cool. You love my sweater. Thanks. This is from, um, it is called the Mayfair. No. Is, it, is this Mayfair? No. Yeah, it is. Um, it is Mayfair. Mayfair group. M-A-Y fair. Like F -A -F -A -I -R, group. Mayfair group. I think it's on sale right now. Oh, Dragon Beauty. This is Nikita Dragon, her brand. Um, and it's the liquid eyeliner. Excited about that. Lots of little goodies down here. Do, do, do. Mented Balms Away Coconut Lip Treatment. Um, Smashbox 
blush lipstick. Ooh, Hourglass. I've always wanted to try Hourglass. It's a little pricey for me, but decided to give that a try. Belief Aqua Bomb Toner. My cat is like staring at me like, what's happening? Uh, heat Protectant. Oh my gosh, I was just posting on, oh, sorry guys. I was just posting that I'm in need of a new heat protectant. Uh, all right, Heritage Store Rose Water Refreshing Facial Splash. Oh, this is what I'm currently using. Benefit Bad Girl Bang Mascara. Love, love, love. Okay, what is this? Oh, Line Soothing Device for New Face. So New Face was actually at the event tonight. Personal esthetician at your fingertips. Um, don't know a lot about them, but I think it's like some sort of tool. I don't have a lot of fine lines, but that's pretty sweet. Uh, Beauty Aura Inside Out Dietary Supplement and Sakara. Oh, I have been wanting to try Sakara as a food service, and they do like some beauty like supplements and bars. You have fine lines. You can have it, Mom. Um, okay, let's see what these papers are. We've got more bags back here. Another Milani mascara. Okie dokes. This bag is cute. Oh, sorry. Missed one thing. Another Revlon matte crayon. This bag is really cute. It's like stretchy. Let's see. Everlane. I've heard of them, but haven't really explored it. Um, so... This is a little like YouTube um, thing to do, do, do and we'll read that later. Okay, moving right along. Smile Direct Club, fast dissolving white strips. Hi Peyton, what's going on? Thanks for joining. Um, so the whitening strips, I always feel like I have good intentions for whitening strips, but then I never like actually end up using them. Hey, hey. Um, this is Heritage by Mindy the volumizing brush i actually have one exactly like this so one thing that i've learned about these blow dry brushes is that they're literally like all made at the same factory and they just like change the colors and like obviously some of them are a little different but like this exact gold like rose gold and black one i have it and it has like a logo on it and that's it <laughs> it's like they all sell the same one it's very weird um so yeah there's that ah! mom do you have one of these or i think you have one um smashbox photo finish primer essence don't know what that means it doesn't look like i have pants on over here on this camera but i have little shorts on um this is dr bronner's pure castile soap if you've got acne this is definitely a good brand for you i used to use that when i was younger okay um uh, amicole light catching highlighter that looks Fun. never heard of this brand but the packaging it's like textured and it looks like um hermes definitely not hermes but it looks like it another um dr bronner's soap a westman altier i've heard of this brand highlight stick let's just open it for fun i, I think my friend uses this you use it to make stuff with your essential oils the dr bronner's Ooh, look at this packaging um this is pretty i think my friend uses this brand oh pretty dark is it see it's like brown but it's kind of sheer actually i was expecting it hey what's up we're doing an unboxing and it's also a magnet that's pretty neat yeah i think this shade is too dark for me that's okay moving right along okay in this bag is a little Tata Harper Vitamin Rich Herbal Complex. Add this to your daily moisturizer and a little scarf. So that's cute. And okay, last box over here. Okay, um, this was a hundred dollar gift card from a brand that they had given us. Jackie Ina. Um, if you guys are big on like YouTube, Jackie Ina. Um, she is like an OG YouTuber and she has a candle company. She's all about like her house being really beautiful and like aesthetic and pretty. And I picked this candle out at her booth. Oh my God, it smells so good. 
Um, this flavor is, it says the scent details, agave nectar, sugared banana, almond blossom. Honestly, all of the flavors, creamy coconut, um, were really unique. They weren't like regular candle smells. I had a cookie. I already ate it. Um, Heritage by Mindy, Lazy Day Dry Shampoo. Okay. I love um, Mindy from Cute Girls Hairstyles. And this is her brand, Heritage. It's sold at Walmart. And um, yeah, I'm excited to give this a try. So cool. What am I going to do with all these products? I'm going to probably try a lot of them. And then anything that doesn't ever work for me, I always give to friends or family and or give it away. Okay. Um, running out of breath here. A rice water hair rinse from Heritage by Mindy. That sounds really nice. I love these sort of applicators where you can literally use the top of this to like go and part your hair and put it in there. I am going to totally try that out in the next day or two. Rice water is so incredibly healthy and good for your hair. More Heritage by Mindy, a gentle daily shampoo. Yippee! Probably most excited about this stuff, honestly. Heritage by Mindy leave-in conditioner. Also excited about that. And let's see. A few things left. What is this? Oh, this is Winnie Harlow's brand. I'll take it out and show you guys. It's called K Skin. Um, and this is her new Deep Water Dew body serum. Now she was drenched in this product, like drenched in it. And it's, I don't want to rip it. I'm probably going to rip it. Um, there we go. Yeah, I ripped it. <laughs> um, she looked absolutely gorgeous and it was like super shimmery. Here's the, kind of looks like Kylie Cosmetics um, font. Let's see if I can just give you a visual here. She put this on me and showed me how it looked. Okay, so it kind of looks like a highlighter on your hand like this. It's kind of a lot, so I have to go this way. But it just, it's so pretty. It's hard to pick up on the camera, but it's got a really nice shimmer to it. And it feels just very light smell, but she was wearing this all over her body. It literally instantly rubbed in. It's not like an oil, it's very, very nice. Okay, MAC Cosmetics blush. We love that. Interesting, I think this is a cream blush. Looks kind of funky. Cream blush, maybe? And woo, Fenty Beauty. Fenty Beauty's shipping our gift box from today. Um, but this is a toner. Or no, a serum. A toner serum. Okay. Um, okay, this brand was, is new to me. They were at the event Uoma, U-O-M-A. Not quite sure how to say that. Hey guys, what's up? This is a trip and smooth face primer. Okay, I lost service for a second. Um, their packaging was really cute. I don't know how this looks. Looks kind of formal. It's actually shimmery. Um, but their booth was really, really cute. Okay. Do, do, do. Last few products. A couple more Fenty items. This is Fenty Icon Semi Matte Lipstick and more K Skin. This is the SPF. Okay. Oh, this is the same brand I just showed you, the Uoma or Uoma. I don't know how to say it. Um, and this is their powder. I will show this to you guys because it was pretty cool. So. Basically, they demonstrated this. It looks like this. And the whole reason they designed it like this is because they don't want you to waste powder because like powders get wasted so easily. So what you do is this bottom part, I'm not gonna do it right now because I'm not gonna use it, but you just twist the bottom part and it fills the bottom with a perfect amount of powder that you need. And then you can just dip your brush or your sponge right in the middle. I thought that was pretty innovative and I had not seen any sort of packaging like that. So I thought that was pretty cool. Okay, moving right along. Um, a little cookie. I've actually tried this brand. I really wanted to like it, but I did not, so that stinks. This brand is called Black Girl Sunscreen. They gave us a few different samples. I am not sure if this works for white skin, but that's fine. Um, I can give it away. 
This is Citizen Cosmetics. So this brand was there and they, I think Sir John was a, is a part of this brand. Um, he or they did a shade match for us on the spot. Their entire brand is just nude lipsticks. And they, um, they did like a shade match to your perfect lipstick shade. And this was apparently mine. So we can test it out and see how they did. They said I got the last one. This is Dubrovnik is the shade. It looks pretty. Hmm. Looks good to me. This lighting on the TikTok one is terrible, but I think it looks pretty. They hit the nail on the head. Um, all right, one tiny little thing left. And that's it. Oh my gosh, thank you guys so much. It's so nice. Um Drama Bomb. This is a nourishing mascara. And I think that is it. We did it. We did it. We did it. We did it. Hey. All right. I'm going to run. This was fun. Um, in case you don't follow me on other platforms, my name is Reagan Bailey across everywhere. I post all sorts of beauty lifestyle content. I am really on a mission to just further educate people about vascular birthmarks because I have one and um, also because I feel like there's a lot of work that needs to still be done. You can see how tired I am. My eyes are so saggy and sleepy. Um, there's a lot of work to be done in the diversity and inclusion space. Um, I think the conversation is just getting started. So I want to be part of that. So that's kind of where I'm at. But anyways, um, yeah, hope you guys have a great day. And I will see you very soon. Bye, guys.